talk to me. You got a girlfriend. I know you've been watching Love is Blind. Yeah, man. So Love Love is Blind, <laughs> for those of you who follow me on Instagram, gets me real hype. And I'm not the type of guy who watches a lot of shows. Yeah. But this thing sucked me in real quick, right? <laughs> and for me, I want to talk about... I don't care if I'm ruining it for anybody here. So we need to talk about AD and Clay. We need to talk mm. about my man Chelsea and Jimmy. I'm not really concerned with Amy and Johnny because they're they're, they're like good. they they're good. They go, or whatever his name is. Yeah, they're yeah. good. They don't care about that. <laughs> but when I see the AD and Clay situation, I'm so, I think they're not going to get married at all. Like so. you could tell that he was the type of dude that once they went on DR, he got a few rounds in him. <laughs> he, he woke up right next to her and was like. I can't spend the rest of my life with this girl, right? All right. So what do you think about it? I'm team Clay. So I just want to point out. <laughs> of course you are. Like, I just want to point out, Jay was rooting against him from the start. He wanted, you wanted her to go with the Matthew guy? Yeah, yeah or the but weirdo then, guy? When we found out he was on, crazy. Like, no, whoa, whoa, time out. Back it up. Because I was also team Trevor before I found out the dude was married, had a girlfriend, like, stuff like that. So let's back it up. Before that information, the guy who was showing her the most amount of attention, the most genuine amount of attention. With the camera show. Was Matthew. Okay, yeah, well, I guess what the camera showed. But. Clay, you can tell the moment he saw her, he got a little mesmerized by her <laughs> voluptuousness, right? Yeah. She stacked, right? Feel me? And so you can tell he was just like, baby, baby. He <laughs> forgot her name. He did. <laughs> he forgot her name. Yo, but, but I, w- I, w- I was going to say, they matched personality-wise. They connected on the Love is Blind tip. Physically, no, they didn't. They because didn't. what he said was... It's it looks are important to me. Oh, okay, okay. And well, she's she like, that box but you know off. what? No, let me back it up too. The reason why she didn't want to give me looks is because you can tell she's the type of chick, at least from my opinion, from what I saw, who leads with her body. So she's like, you know what? I want to try a different experiment this time, <laughs> where I fall in love with somebody based upon my personality. Because you can tell that that body has got her. Yeah, he was places. the only guy. He walked her back to the door closing. He was <laughs> yeah, feeling her. He was feeling the looks. He was feeling. For sure. And then, but what really did him in, though, was he keeps repeating, I don't want to cheat on you. I don't want to cheat on you. Uh -uh. Ladies, ladies, as a man, he keeps repeating that. He's probably going to do it. (laughs) Right? So, Fellas, if you feel that way, say it one time. And that's (laughs) it. Move on. (laughs) Move on. (laughs) Yeah. All you have to do is move on, not do do anything extra with that type of stuff. All right. So you Um, got Chelsea and and Jimmy? Dog. Chelsea and... So Chelsea and Jimmy... So love is blind. The reason I like it is because I love to study human behavior informally. I don't have any degree in it, right? Mm-hmm. You know how they always tell you, don't be too available. Don't be too much in the beginning. Yeah. Don't love too hard. Blah, blah, blah. Let them earn it. What Trevor went through, putting aside his off-camera activities that he was, he ended up being having a girlfriend, whatever. But before that, you know, he made it clear. I like you. I don't care about how, how you look. I'm not talking to anybody else. He was as available as as straightforward and as, as honest as a man can be. And remember, Chelsea was available. Available, yeah. <laughs> available. But Chelsea and Chelsea came on the show saying, Hey, I want to find love. I want somebody who treats me well. Trevor was gonna check all those boxes out. Meanwhile, you had F boy Jimmy talking to two girls. <laughs> And he made the wrong decision. <laughs> so, he, made the wrong, he can't do the child. Yeah, he can't yeah. do the child. He, 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 was, he was talking to two girls. He even told Chelsea he was talking to two girls. And Chelsea even liked them more. Does that sound familiar to a it's, lot of you yeah. on the looking on the camera People right like now? what they can't have. Exactly. People want what they can't have. And I yeah. kept repeating that to my girl. People want what they can't have. We've all been there. We've yeah. all been attracted to the person not giving us as much attention, not texting us as much. And, and the person is not good for us. That, and a person yeah. who's definitely not good for <laughs> us, right? And not me. I'm, I'm perfectly happy now. No, but that, that's the one thing. Before I had met my, my girl, um, when I lived in London and I was single... There was definitely a lot of that cat and mouse exciting, right? Yeah. Like toxicity and stuff like that. That was great. But mm-hmm. like when you're trying to find a mature type of love, like my girl always says, if he really wants to, he would, right? If you really want to do something, you would. Don't say that. Don't put that. No, I want to put that out there. I'm just saying, if you really want to do something, you would. That goes for girls too. That mm. goes for girls too. That's not just right, a dude thing. Talking, yeah. That's not right, just a exactly. dude thing. It's both ways. It's both, both ways, ways, man. It's two ways. Both ways, yeah. So anyway, my thoughts on that is Jimmy's not gonna if Jimmy says yes to that, 
is just for the Instagram and the cameras because he's going to divorce her right after, right? Because I just don't see the chemistry. Chelsea's definitely very insecure. Very. Very insecure. That's a turnoff. Mm -hmm. He can't even have, I mean, how, what do you think about the fact that he told her that he slept with her, the friend that she introduced him to? That's a rookie. He was wow. Yeah, he was, he was wow. <laughs> but she even she gave herself away too. She came when they met. She said, "Oh, Jimmy turning down. S he's never done that." Or he would. Do that like I would have looked at her like, <laughs> "What are you doing?" Not that. I but to be honest, though, I think they really are friends. Cause she came on a show like you. She I, wanted to come for the airtime, man. For the, nah, I, everybody's trying I to get clout on this show, man. <laughs> I think they're the type of friends where if they both single, it could go down. But they respect each other's relationships. Okay, it's, I guess fine. Well, wait, before we, we have to edit that, yeah, we might, <laughs> yeah. But before, before we, uh, I guess before we move on to the next hot take topic, what do you think about Sarah Ann hitting up uh, Jeremy, even while she knew she was engaged? What a bim bop, man! What a, yeah, that was disrespectful. Yeah. That, as was, that was that. You know, that was very disrespectful, but. Granted, the the nature of how they met and it's the show. Yeah, it's like if you're really looking for love and there's a connection, you could throw that out. Because honestly, <laughs> when you choose somebody, <laughs> it's not necessarily that you're gonna marry them or, or anything like that. It's it's still a game show, not even a game show. It's still a show, it's an experiment. and it's still it's experiment, and they still have to get to that altar and say, um, you know, I marry you. I think I mean I mean I do. I think it was uh, what is it? It was Jeremy's fault for playing into it. That's true. He, he, he kept but he that liked, door but he open. Like, remember, he liked it. Yeah, he liked it. He and kept then he that told Laura open. about it. And I was like, yo, my man, if you got a message like that, just delete it. Yeah, just delete it. And move on with your life. And don't even yeah. tell your girl because exactly. that's just going to bring issues right yeah. into your life. Yeah. Because Had he, that in the back burner if you ever wanted to. <laughs> oh, I know she reached her eye. <laughs> Things no, don't yeah. reach out to Laura. You double back. You know? You feel me? So, no. And but, you won't look like a creep because you'll be like, I didn't message you because I was... <laughs> I was engaged. That didn't work out. Now I'm free to, hey, is that offer still available? Reach out to Mike for head coaching advice. 